Okay. We're back and we realize that maybe this isn't gonna change. Maybe we just got lucky. It's two days in a row. Which one? Alright, that's getting me 50 to my life. I can upgrade these. me some Dionysus. You know what? Let's do it. All right, one more time. One more time. One more time. Let's game play a little bit. Just what I wanted. Who would have thought? Stinking, and I think you got yourself a bottle of ambrosia there. I had no idea you could get that stuff downstairs. Do me a solid, though. Hang on to any more you find, or better yet, give it away. I'd hate to think even a drop has gone to waste. Hmm. Oh, oh boy. It is probably the case that you still have a long and painful road ahead.
Nice try, Key. Trying to murder me. in hell without my help would like to understand you made a big mistake there little hades just you watch all right i'm sorry uncle
My subjects wish to have a word with you. Got their attention. not the type of flattery I'm used to. Never met a god that bleeds like you, Red. Like a worthless mortal. Come on, let's bleed you dry.
Asphodel Meadows.
secret underworld death dealer. I so look forward to the pain you shall. Hmm. This is my fight. Spoon dried oregano, two spoons extra virgin olive oil, oh. one large onion, minced, a dash of salt to taste, and wait. Oh, Jeez. Time to pick up the pace. one, huh?
guess it'll just be a quick one. Something wrong there, sir. I mean, what's the use? Let's say we fought, if anybody asks. Now go. I've no quarrel with you. Besides, I'll just remain here comfortably at rest for some un. Okay. Thanks, sir. the fighting me. Well, I see you playing, short one. I too will...
location that we need. Got you, Asterius. Your father must have told you that his governance over the underworld is due more to the weaving of the fates than by his choice. Admittedly, he got the short end of the stick. Whereas Poseidon and myself, why, we've been doing rather well indeed. Is my hair sticking up? Take it. More bright swords?
business. Rematch. Well, hell's. Yeah. Shouldn't I be the champion of Elysium now that I've beaten you? Isn't there someone else around to challenge me? Say, Her <laughs> ah, <laughs> very clever fiend, invoking Heracles' name in an attempt to drive me to a jealous rage. <laughs> it shall not work, but you shall dearly pay, nevertheless. Shades. <sighs> hmm. 
pass up slain fellows. That was Elysium. in hell. Take that. 
was a wealthy vermin. There it is already. Disgusting. Cerberus will love it. Hmm. Phew. I can leave or explore more tunnels. Huh. All right, boy, I got your favorite treat. But you have to promise to let me pass if I hand it over, okay? Okay, so I need to... Terrifying Cerberus accepts the fetid sack and scans the darkened hall for where best Need to cut out the bit where I saw this was a bad run. Turning contents. Okay. I owe you one, boy. <laughs> Not really. Go I out. I just leave. This is fine. I'm sure there's nothing. I'm done. Game over. Back it up. Look at that. Wow. Of course. No. I never grew accustomed to the air up here. It gusts senselessly whichever way it pleases. I suppose you must prefer it to the stillness of the air below. You know you're right. The air up here seems pretty good so far. But I will reserve judgment till I've had my fill. I have to say though, Father, the Helm of Darkness suits you. I'm touched you dust it off on my account. It should not have had to come to this. For all your antics with me yet around the house, I always kept my temper, have I not? Unlike you. Well, let's see. You've berated me repeatedly and often. You've lied to me, mustered your wretched forces to kill me over and over, but sure, I'll grant you that you've always kept most of your anger bottled up. All that's about to change, then? Nah, I'm sure he's just gonna We're let me go. God's boy. Killing one another is a lot. Although I always thought I was above it. I told you that you cannot leave this place. It seems I must enforce my rules myself. Oh, okay. I'm sending you home. Now. No, you're going home with me. Alright, just go well. I suppose that you must hate the very sight of me. You'll understand then why I wear the helm of darkness.
vile and ungrateful child. I would expect such treatment from my brothers, but from you... Ugh. Enough of this! I owe you any favors here. You'll answer me one question and I'll give it some thought. How's that? I know your question, boy. But ask it anyway. Persephone. My mother. Why did she leave? I... Blood and darkness. There is no escape. just now.
I made it. Beyond the frozen overlook, await the first glimpse of the sun to your left, and onward through the cold. Sure hope this works, Nix. Okay, do I have to control? surface, windswept, racked by freezing cold, nonetheless instills within the prince a sense of awe and the sublime, for it is unlike anything that he has seen. It's beautiful. you be wandering all the way out here you're trespassing on private property you know speak up um you must be Persephone my name is Zagreus and I think I might be your son what how dare get out of here get out or I shall make you out with you no so then you are her I, I don't care if you hate me, but I'm not leaving until I get some answers. I never even knew you existed. Why did you leave me? You died. You... you died. Those burning feet, they... sputtered out when you were born. But... now you're standing here before me. How? I died? I died? What, you mean permanently died? But I'm alive. Oh, God. You never even knew I existed either. Alive? Sagrius, he... even kept your name. You live? How can this be? You live? You live? Oh, the cruel fates! My son! Mother. Hmm. Okay. In short, I beat him, finally, <laughs> though he did everything he could to prevent our meeting here like this. But there's something he wanted me to tell you in the end. He said to tell you Cerberus is doing very well. Ah, uh, he told you that, did he? That's good. That's good. Though, tell me something, Zagreus. How is it that you found me? To have journeyed all this way, I scarce believe it. Zagreus? Uh, oh, it's... guess I'm just a little tired, that's all. Not accustomed to the weather, as I think you call it. No. No, that mm. isn't it. It's that... You cannot stay here. You can't stay here. Really, you're... <laughs> kicking me out? Why? The fates are cruel, Zagreus. You're bound to that place. Same as your father. So they would have us say goodbye, for now. My heart soars knowing you live. But then it breaks that our time together was so brief. No, I can come back. I can come back. Now that I found you, he... Maybe he'll just let me come back. You tell him I demand it. And I demand he also tell me how come he... Or for that matter, Nyx, never sent notice that you lived. Olympus is all rife with schemers. But I was so naive to think that they were different. Hmm. I'll tell him. I'll tell him. I 
feel awful. I... I have to go. The stick shall take you then. Oh, Zagreus. Farewell, my son. Won't you come back to me? When you are able, please, come back. I shall be waiting here. However long it takes. <laughs> However long it takes. <gasps> Can't hold on. Mother, I have to get back there. I just did that, sir. He's finally returned. You are late, boy. Have you any idea what time it is? No. Wait, what? I vanquished you in single combat and finally found Mother, and that's all you have to say to me. <laughs> Nonsense. Don't you think I would recall such an event? You can't be serious. You're going to pretend as though it never happened. She wants answers, same as I do. She demands you let me pass. Let me go to her again. Silence. This discussion is over. I hardly think this is the time or place to indulge your overwrought imagination. I know where we can continue this discussion, then. Say, Orpheus, you wouldn't happen to know the nymph Eurydice, would you? Tall, woodsy type. I get the impression maybe you know each other. What? Why, yes, I know Eurydice. Or, I once knew her, I should say. Why ever would you ask me such a thing, my friend? I saw her, mate, in Asphodel. She's doing fine up there, all on her own. The two of you, you used to know each other then. We more than knew each other, Zagreus. We were husband and wife. She was my muse. To think that we are doomed to be apart during our afterlives. Oh well. Oh well. Ah oh, well. Don't you have a message I could bring to her if we should meet again, something like that? I do not wish to trouble her again, my friend. Speak not to her of me, all right? I have my memory of her. It is enough. It is enough. You can child. Uh, mm, mm. All right. Nix. Your father fell to you as once his father fell to him, although you were substantially more merciful. I know it is a bitter victory at best. Hmm. Though, tell me, what transpired subsequently that you have returned? Did you locate your birth mother? I did. I, she was there. She was where you said she'd be, and more than I imagined, but I had so little time with her. I can't survive up there for very long. Why didn't you tell me I'd just die no matter what? Oh, my child. I say this seldomly, but I did not know, or I did not wish to believe, that the service would have such an effect on you. But it seems you share your father's fate, after all. My father's fate? But he was smugly waiting for me up there and seemed quite healthy all in all. Though, maybe the farther we get from this realm, the worse we get. Because he cast his lot, inheriting the underworld. So I now presume, you are bound to this realm by powers greater even than mine. Tell me something. If you knew that you could only see Persephone for but a moment's time, would you still make the journey to her there? Yes. Yes, I would. Hmm. I had so many questions left for her. Then go and ask them, child. Steady your resolve and find her there again. And use well what brief time you have with one another whilst you can. As mortals do. As mortals do. Hmm. Zagreus, please tell me that the rumors are untrue. You really vanquished him. Have you completely lost your mind? You're going to destroy this blasted house. Come on, Meg. Father had it coming for some time. What's your concern besides? The house is safe. He's not going to take this lying down. He'll find some way to take it out on you, on all of us. You watch yourself or all of us will pay. Hmm. I will not let that happen. I have to tell you, Dusa, your job seems really stressful here. It's a big house. 
You have to tend to the entire thing. Interesting. Well, most of it isn't so bad at all. But ever since Cerberus tore up the lounge, I guess it's been a little hectic getting everything back to normal like before. I'm not sure it was ever normal around here, but I'm sorry I created work for you. Cerberus tore the place apart because of me. So maybe I can help you patch things up. Don't say that, Prince. Cerberus knows better, and besides, you have your job to do, don't you? And I have mine. And I will do my very best at it. Just wait and see. And she's off. <laughs> Goodbye. Bye. Wretched Broker, what's new, my friend? 14 keys. Right. Any less of each boon. I found her, sir. My mother, she's alive and well, and... Uh, but I just couldn't stay up there for very long. I have to get back to her. You really made it all the way? You must have gotten past your father. That's amazing, lad. But wait, what was she like? What happened to you there? She was... she was great. Nothing like father, more like you a little bit, I guess. Though being on the surface, it just seemed to suck the life right out of me. Even without the wretches of the underworld trying to do me in. But then you had a little time, at least. Sounds like you have unfinished business with her there. You got to her this once. Surely you're able to again, isn't that right? Hmm. It is. I have to speak with her. Interesting. free after all. Sort of. Hmm. Fifteen of those. Oh my goodness. I wonder if those are just made for like after you. Let's see. a pack of punishment on it. Let's see here. Okay. Well, okay, we didn't even rank up or rank up once. From Cerberus. Boyo, next time you make it to the big VIP area upstairs, you watch out for those weapon-wielding gents out there. The eyeball soul thing that pops out when you beat them? You gotta squash those too, or else they'll grab their gear and come right back. Crush the souls of Elysium's exalted shades to stop them from regenerating over and over. I'll definitely do that next time I'm there. Thanks. Alright. That's about everything. I don't know if I will... Another day in Tartarus. Record night, myself playing I no more. Idea. I definitely won't be playing this daily anymore. Uh, I'm probably gonna move on to... Link to the Past, play that a little bit, try to beat that. I also got, um, what was it, uh, Return of the Obra Dinn. There's a lot of stuff here. I do want to see more. See what happens when we get there again, but, yeah. Apparently Dionysus was my, my boy there. what I can upgrade here. I just the uh, monies. Yeah. I don't know. We'll see. I think I'll be it for now. I don't think daily Hades will be daily much longer, but maybe try a couple more runs. Maybe I'll just record them and put them up if I actually beat Hades and see the rest of the stuff. I don't know. We'll see.